So in this video, we are going to derive the 3D rotation matrix that represents a rotation of 90 degrees anti-clockwise about the z-axis. Okay, so what we're going to be doing is we're looking down the z-axis and rotating about that. So any point that is on the z-axis, including 001, will remain fixed, will remain as is. Okay, so we can already write in the third column as 001. That will remain fixed. Now, if I'm looking down the z-axis, you've got to imagine it as being like a bird's eye view. So looking down, if you're at the top corner of the room, looking down towards the floor, what you would see is the x-axis coming out like that, the y-axis coming out like that. Here is the point 0, 1, 0. And here is the point 1, 0, 0. OK? Now, if we were rotating 90 degrees anti-clockwise, OK? So that way would be clockwise. Anti-clockwise would be this way. Uh, the point 1, 0, 0 will rotate round onto 0, 1, 0. So 1, 0, 0 will become 0, 1, 0. And 0, 1, 0 would rotate round to here. OK, now this point here, because that's the x-axis, remember, there's 1, 0, 0. This would have to be minus 1, 0, 0. So 0, 1, 0 has gone to minus 1, 0, 0. And so this must represent a rotation of 90 degrees anti-clockwise about the z-axis.